Ladies and gentlemen, you know who that is. Blonde, smiling, badass, Adidas knows it, Dove knows it, Dimatize knows it, Gleason's knows it. Who did I leave out? Barkley Center knows it. Barkley Center knows it. But is it ever going to happen again? Uh, okay, for, for quick, for people who don't know, they, I don't know who the fucking shadowy they is, they've been freezing out boxing. Been, been September, no fights. October, no fights. November, going to be no fights. December, when? You, you got any intel on when boxing is going to be allowed back in New York? All in? We're here at Barclays Center for a January 14th gig that we think is going to go through. Where fingers are freaking crossed. What, what's the you got any intel, Heather Hardy? Um, no more than you do, Mike. All right. It looks yeah. like uh, you know the government is keep saying next year, next year, next yeah. year, and they're hopeful that obviously that in the beginning of the yeah. year will be covered. But I think the problem is that yeah. the the state doesn't put a face to their choices a lot. They make choices and they say, well, you right. know, they're athletes, they're fine, but right. you know. The people in the ring are, the sport is so much bigger than just us. Right. It's like the guys that do the interviews, the guys that make the t-shirts, right. the guys that print the flyers. Right. Like, this is hurting so many people right. with this six month freeze. You right. Know? Uh, we're just hopeful that cooler, saner heads are going to prevail and going to find the insurance situation that's going to allow cards big and small to get back on track. Uh, let's pretend and moving forward as though that's going to happen when are you going to fight again uh looks like i'll be boxing back here in march on the garcia card um really excited about that we, we believe that is going to land here yeah yeah Good. but today like in a couple minutes i'm going to announce that okay first quarter early next year i'm going to be doing my first mma fight so wow dude it's not a replacement i never leave boxing yeah. i will be back here in yeah. march but just as an addition. We know when and where that's going to be? We don't know. I know that I'm fighting for Invicta, but we're not... Uh, Invicta is Invicta, the name of the organization. Right? We're okay. in the middle of contract, so, okay. you know, for now, it's early next year. Going to be able to do it in New York to see, or we don't know where that card's going to be? You know what? Mm. Not for my first one, but I said high. Yeah. I set the bar high, so I, I'd hope my fans will see me by the year out here at, at Barclays. And you know the big name in MMA is UFC. Is that ultimately the desire, the goal? It's. I think it's the goal for every fighter, okay. MMA fighter. The same sure. way that you know you want to win a world title in boxing, you want to win a UFC title. Right. So we're gonna now moving forward have to refer to you as boxer slash mixed martial artist. I kind of like mixed martial artist because the word artist is in there. Yeah. It sounds classy. I'm still classy. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, uh, well, yeah, you're 994 percent. Right. The 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 non-classy comes out at the appropriate times. Right. Right. When, when you kick some asses or what have you. Any other news you want to report? No, I think that's it. I think that's a great item to to leak. Let me hurry up and get this out on the YouTube and get the exclusive. Thank you, Heather Hardy.